When it comes to protecting your smart home, there are many things that you can do, like having a strong network password, using an up-to-date router, and monitoring your network. There are many apps out there that can monitor your network and protect your smart home, but there's one app that I would highly recommend specifically, and that app is called Fang. And the best part is that it's completely free to use. Fing is the number one network scanner platform worldwide with over 100 million downloads and available as a free download for iOS, Android, Mac, and Windows. Fing gives you the ability to do a full network scan on either a home or business network and see all the devices that are currently connected to your network, either connected through ethernet or wireless and various ways to manage these devices. This video is sponsored by Fing, but I can honestly say that Fing is a tool that I actually use in my smart home and I would still recommend them even if they were not sponsoring me. So how exactly does the app Fing protect your smart home? Well there are many ways but here's five crucial ways that the app Fing can protect your smart home. And at the end of the video I will show you some practical ways that you can use this app in your smart home. The first way the Fing app can protect your smart home is by showing you what devices are currently connected to your network. This includes devices like phones, tablets, and smart devices like smart plugs, smart lights, and smart cameras. You can do an unlimited amount of scans and there's no limit to how many devices that this app can detect. I'm using the Mac app here and here you can see all the devices that are connected to my network. To rescan the network just hit refresh to start the scan and it'll look for devices that are connected to your network, either connected through ethernet or wireless. Each device has a label next to it with what type of device it is, like a thermostat or smart plug, and a brief description of what the device is and the brand. You're able to view specific data about the device as well, like the IP address, the Mac address, address and this really clean summary page that organizes the devices by overall category like personal, smart home, and protection. And the devices are organized by type of device like phone, tablet, or smart plug. You can dive deeper into a device and see virtually all the information about the device. Once you click on a device, say like this smart plug here, you can view things like the IP and the MAC address, when it was last seen on your network, the brand, and what smart home platforms that it supports. Now all this information will vary by device. And later on, I'll show you what you can do with this information. The second way that the Fing app can protect your smart home is by showing you your network health. This is important so you can make sure that your network and your router are operating normally so all your devices will be working correctly. Here in the app, you'll see your internet provider and you can do a speed test of your network to make sure you're getting about the speeds that you're actually paying for. This speed test is a good way to know if there are any devices that are hogging your internet and slowing your network down. You can receive internet performance reports and see any outages that your internet provider may have had recently as well. Now all these features that I've just mentioned like network scanning and network health are completely free to use in the Fing app and makes understanding what's going on in your network very easy and a very easy to use app. Fing is free to use without an account, but if you want access to additional features that can protect your smart home even more, then an account is required. If you want full monitoring and protection for all of your devices, like advanced security checks and the ability to block or pause a device from accessing your network, there is a premium plan available for these features. And by using the link down in the description below of this video, you'll get a 25% discount for six months on their monthly premium plan. The premium plan gives you some extra features Features to protect your smart home and here are some of the best features. The third way that the Fing app can protect your smart home is by alerting you about changes on your network while you're either home or away. When a new device joins your network, whether it be a phone, a tablet, or a smart device, you'll receive an alert when that device joins. So you can be aware if it's a device that you recently added to your network or if it's a suspicious device that you need to take action with. On the opposite side of that, you can receive a push notification when a device is online or goes offline from a specific network. This feature can be enabled for all devices or a specific device. Say if you want to monitor a smart home hub that needs to be online all the time for some of your smart devices to work and be alerted when it goes offline. The fourth way that the Fing app can protect your smart home is with their newest feature, block and pause. This gives you complete control to manage if a device can connect to your network or not. Blocking a device gives you the ability to permanently block unwanted devices from connecting to your network, either hardwired or wirelessly. This could be a device or multiple devices devices that are hogging your network and slowing down other devices on the network. Or if it's a device on your network that you don't recognize and seems a little suspicious, then you can just block this device. Along with the ability to auto 
automatically block all new devices that try to join your network. You can also pause the connection to a device. This is useful if you're a parent and you want to limit the screen time of your child's device. You're able to pause the connection for a temporary amount of time from 30 minutes to a week or manually re-enable the connection. This works on all connected devices, including gaming consoles, tablets, and smart TVs without having to install anything on the device that you want to pause the connection on. Another use case is if there's a device that's hogging your network, then you can just pause the connection instead of having to block the device completely. Now, typically to block or pause a connection to a device on your network, this requires logging into your router and trying to find the device, and this can just be too complicated. The Thing app makes this process extremely easy with just a few clicks. For better protection and security, this feature is only available for private home networks and not for business networks. It's also only available on the desktop version of Thing, available on Mac and Windows. The fifth way the Thing app can protect your smart home is with tools for advanced monitoring and troubleshooting your network. Thing offers many tools to monitor your network. On a basic level, there is network scanning, blocking and pausing, and the ability to run speed tests. Advanced features include the ability to ping a device by IP address, trash out, Mac and DNS lookup, and one of the most useful features, finding hidden cameras on your network. These premium features like finding hidden cameras on your network are available for premium users only. With all the ways the Thing app can protect your smart home, what are some practical ways they can use this app in your smart home? Well, the Thing app allows you to get the IP address of your devices. And with the IP address, you're able to connect to the web interface of devices that don't have a mobile app to manage the settings. This includes devices like routers, managed switches, firewalls, and third-party bridges or hubs like Hoobs or the Starling Hub in order to add devices into HomeKit that don't natively work with HomeKit. I actually use this often for adjusting settings on my printer that does not have a mobile app. This way, I can go to the IP address and adjust the settings as needed. Thing's primary focus is to provide you with tools to protect against data theft. And all the data in the Thing app is protected using industry standards for encryption and data protection, along with being GDPR compliant, a law to protect users' data. Thing is honest and open about what data they collect from you and what they do with this data. In fact, all of the data Thing has is fully visible by you in your account and can be deleted. I'll leave a link down below if you want to read more about their privacy information. Thing is a well-recognized company and has been featured on websites like Mashable, The Washington Post, CNN, and they're a brand I can personally get behind. Thing is a great tool to have in your smart home toolkit for protecting your smart home by monitoring your network for free and helping you take action on devices if need be like blocking or pausing with a premium subscription. And by using the link down in the description below of this video, you'll get a 25% discount for six months on their monthly premium plan. And a huge thank you to Thing for sponsoring today's video. Thank you for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one.